So here we have my first gear fleet. Everything from the rollout truck down to the Peak 520s are all MCS. And here we have some more customs that were done. I'm crazy about these things. That's one that I did in tribute to 2479. I wanted an MR, and I wish I could have found a how, but she'll do. Bob at Granite State Collectibles did that one for me. And I got one of the old uh, waste management MRs and one of the custom ones that Mac did with the MR. So the ones I'm most proud of, this is one that Anthony Riccio did, did for me. And it's a northern waste truck. Um, man, this thing just spoke volumes to me. The actual truck and the replica. I lost a couple aunts to breast cancer, so that one's special to me. And it all goes into my colors on, you know, that I want for the company, which as you can see, the pink and blue. Um, Anthony did this one for me too. I love this truck. <laughs> Man, that thing is gorgeous. Could you guys see a fleet of these out on the road? Did an excellent job on this one. I actually took the decals off. I wasn't too happy with how they came out. So, eventually I may put some, some more on it, but I'm not in a rush. A rollout truck that Bob did. And these are some little goodies that my brother sent me. Still got them, Alan. <laughs> Bob did this one some years back for me. Got more of a BFI blue to it. And a lighter pink. I actually prefer the darker pink and the um, metallic blue. Yep, it's my girls. And over here, <laughs> uh oh, sorry about that. Got the old progressive squeezy. There's a little something, something they gave me at DeKalb County when I was there, customer service award. I kept it out. I'm not too big on awards and stuff like that, but I thought it was pretty cool. My mom made me keep it. That baby needs some work. <laughs> My children got to it when they were younger. I've had that truck for years. Um, and they had a little fun with it. Some belt buckles that Alan sent me. Don't mind him. <laughs> I'm a little different. I like to collect those for some reason. That's a beautiful bug when it actually emerges from out of the ground and sheds its skin but I've collected those since I was little move my cat food out the way and one of the green lights I had a couple more but I gave them to my grandson and this was a gift from my brother that I got hired on with DSNY ultimately he went and did something else but man I really appreciate that Got a lot of carts in the window too. You guys can see. Yep. 
Truck pictures. That's pretty much it. Just want to show you guys a little of what I got. My youngest son did this when he was about, say, five. <laughs> that was uh, a little montage he did for the crane carrier when I had it. He used to love to ride with me. I always thought that was cool. I'm a pack rat. I hold on to stuff, you know, from the kids, things they made and whatnot. My second oldest son made this when he was in preschool. It actually used to have a candy necklace that was going around it, but <laughs> that was a long time ago. He's in his 20s now. Birthday card that one of my other sons drew me. And some more awards and stuff. That's the tag from my um, crane carrier. You're supposed to turn them in, but I held on to it. <laughs> I had actually found that for the Peterbilt when I thought it was actually getting fixed. But I held on to it because never know. May end up getting that truck back and replacing the engine on it when I can. It's in good hands right now. Um, but yeah, that's it, guys. Take care.